The National FAA Safety Team presents Aircraft Performance Monitoring. Recently, the General Aviation Joint Steering Committee System Component Failure Workgroup identified release safety enhancements dealing with engine maintenance and flight data monitoring. We want to take just a few minutes to talk about best practices for reciprocating engine maintenance and operation and the safety benefits of flight data monitoring, a technology and process that's now coming to general aviation. We'll look at present and future FDM technologies, and we'll talk about how to use FDM today. The pilot's operating handbook will help you to predict your aircraft's performance, but only by monitoring your personal performance can you know what to expect. Comparing your performance with the POH will enable you to develop accurate performance predictions and reasonable performance expectations. Changes in aircraft performance can presage developing mechanical issues. Taken together, that adds up to safer flight operations. Flight data monitoring has been around since before the jet age, and modern airplanes make extensive use of the technology. Systems comprise of sensors, computer hardware, and software acquire and archive flight data for use in trend analysis and investigations of accidents and incidents. While it's true that most general aviation aircraft don't have dedicated automatic flight data recording devices now, we will be able to enjoy the benefits of equipment in the future. In the meantime, it's often surprising to see what we already have. Manufacturers are already offering self-contained flight data and visual data recorders for general aviation airplanes and helicopters. Most operators of this equipment must periodically download and analyze the recorded data, often with the aid of dedicated computer programs. Many data monitoring operations involve no automation at all. Flight engineers used to handle the monitoring and record keeping, and test pilots were expected to keep notes while flying. General aviation pilots can do much of the same thing by tracking engine power, fuel flow, oil temperature, and pressure. Panel-mounted GPS systems and many handheld units are already capable of recording position, heading, speed, and altitude. Some engine monitors have recording capability, and many aircraft owners participate in oil analysis programs, a tool for gauging engine health and heading off expensive, or in some cases, disastrous problems. Some aircraft, particularly helicopters, are equipped with metallic chip detectors that can forecast engine and transmission failure in time to make a safe landing. Here's just one example of the information available in one small box. This example doesn't include recording capability, but it's certainly one-stop shopping for engine information. And don't forget basic instrumentation such as airspeed indicators, attitude indicators, angle of attack, manifold pressure, RPM, and G indicators all of which give immediate feedback as to whether design limitations have or are about to be exceeded. At present, general aviation flight data monitoring technology ranges from a little less than 10,000 to more than 20,000, but as competition and equipage increases, prices are expected to fall. We're already seeing multi-sensor analysis programs on high-end GA aircraft. Here we see a graphic representation of landing performance by airport. With integrated performance, navigation, and route information, almost anything is possible. In this case, the aircraft operator can adjust company operations and pilot training programs to ensure safe landing performance at each destination. Documenting your landing performance manually can yield the same result. If you find you're consistently landing long or short, you can adjust your approaches to land on the sweet spot. It's interesting to consider all of the flight data required to carry out a successful autonomous landing. Auto landing systems are already making their way into some general aviation aircraft now, and, over time, they'll become available in lower priced platforms. That same data can be useful in refining your aircraft control right now. We are certainly in an age of innovation where information, technology, and pilot performance combine to make flying safer than ever before. Soon, performance data will be automatically collected, processed, and made available to general aviation pilots. In the meantime, we urge you to consider the information that's already available on every flight. There's nothing like the feeling you get when you know you're playing your A game, and in order to do that, you need a good coach. So fly regularly with a CFI who will challenge you to review what you know, explore new horizons, and they challenge you to always do your best. Of course, you'll have to dedicate time and money to your proficiency program, but it's well worth it for the peace of mind that comes with confidence. And be sure to document your achievement in the WINGS proficiency program. It's a great way to stay on top of your game and keep your flight review current. If you have any questions regarding this presentation, you can come to our Facebook page, Main Flying, and post your questions, or on the YouTube channel below, or you can always seek out your local CFI or contact your local FISDO for an FAA safety team representative near you. Thanks for watching this video, and remember, you are a vital member of our general aviation safety community.